excuses for not keeping the Sabbath, there are many. Not very good ones, by the way, but there are many. Uh, let's see. What else have I heard? Oh, oh, I know. Uh, well, how can you know when the Sabbath is? Uh, time's been lost. We don't know that the seventh day is the seventh day. Maybe the seventh day is the first day. Maybe the first day is the fourth day. Maybe time's been lost. How can you know which day is which? Well, first of all, have you ever lost track of what day it is? I'm sure you have. I have too. What did you do? You said, excuse me, sir, do you, what day is it? And that person turned around and said, I don't know. And he turned around, hey, what day is it? We don't know. It gets on the intercom. Excuse me, all Walmart shoppers. Does anybody in this Walmart know what day it is? Answer, no, no one knows in Walmart what day it is. And then you go out and maybe you call it the President of the United States. Do you know what day? No, he, he doesn't know. No one knows. And, you, and, and, and no one knows. No one knows. There's a time in history when everybody went brain dead and forgot what day it was. Well, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. So the illusion that, well, we all lost time is just an illusion. I mean, that, that weekly cycle of seven day period, weekly cycle, six days of work, one of rest, the Sabbath day, the seventh day, has always been in existence. It's always been in existence. Now, here's what you're responsible for. You're responsible for what you know is right. Get you a dictionary and look up the first day of the week. Look up the word Sunday. What does it tell you? Well, yeah, it tells you that the day that most people go to church on, they're wrong, but it is the day that most people go to church on. But it will also say the first day of the week. Then look up in your dictionary the word Saturday, and it will say the seventh day of the week. And then you connect that up with the fourth commandment that says keep the seventh day of the week. You are responsible for what you know to be right. And you can know what is right. You just don't want to know. Okay, so Check us out on the web at isthatreallyinthebible.com.